Intuit is extremely proud to sponsor this year's Tribute to Women Awards for the ninth time since 2002. At Intuit, we know that diversity creates inclusion, inspiration, and innovation. For 30 years, we've remained committed to developing our female talent and to empowering women everywhere with tools that help them achieve their professional and financial dreams. As the executive sponsor for Intuit's Women in Technology program, every day we're working to create an environment where technical women can thrive. On behalf of Intuit, I'd like to congratulate Noelle Eder, one of this year's honorees. Noelle is an exceptional and influential leader with a proven ability to inspire and transform organizations by winning the hearts and minds of employees and leaders. Her innovative approaches have led Intuit to rethink customer care from being a necessary cost center to being a strategic asset in creating awesome products and driving growth for the company. Congratulations, Noelle, and to all the award winners. Sometimes a setback or a roadblock may be just a sign that it's time to go in a different direction. At a previous company, I was interviewing to be chief of staff for our CEO. I didn't get the position. However, I did get a lot of exposure with the executive team. It was the best job I never got. As a result, different offers were made to me down the road, including my first vice president position and also managing my first P&L. One of the most valuable experiences of my career so far has been learning to not control the future. We all have our path, and we may think we know what that path looks like, but the path can change. And rather than fight the change, I've learned to embrace it and celebrate it. By being okay with change, I can stay in the present today, benefit from the opportunities that are presented to me, and learn and grow and let tomorrow show up when it does. Henry Ford used to say, whether you think you can or you can't, you're right. And so in the spirit of those words, picture where you want to be, believe in yourself, don't sell yourself short, aim high. I have to start by saying I love my job. Why? Because it's about people. I get to connect people to opportunity and possibility inside of my company. But what's most rewarding is the transition point that we find ourselves in with inclusion. You see, now it's about creating value through people and the technologies that we sell. The end result is that we're creating environments where talented people can thrive. And the net result is that we then create value not only for Cisco, but for every single customer and partner we sell to. First of all, let me say how grateful I am to have been chosen for this wonderful award. I think the YWCA and its work nationally and internationally embodies the service ideal that I see also at San Jose State. As Dean of the College of Social Sciences, we're very involved in community work. Uh, in particular, our Com University partnership between the community, the university, and the city. Uh, a new program we have called the Credential in Real Estate Development that brings together developers and planners to groups that often have trouble understanding each other. And I see my role in that is facilitating those kinds of partnerships and collaborations that make the work so gratifying for everybody in the college and in the community. Uh, it's been a wonderful career and a wonderful place to work. And again, I'm most, most grateful for this. Thank you. In honor of my mother, a breast cancer survivor, I've been actively involved with Breast Cancer Emergency Fund. My mother suffered breast cancer a few years ago and it was a devastating event for her, but she came back even stronger. 
She is my moral compass. She's allowed me to learn from her experience and it's an opportunity now for me to give back to the community through Breast Cancer Emergency Fund. This year, the Oracle Women Leadership participated as volunteers for this old bag event. And it's through this event that it's given me an opportunity to give back to the community.